It's a big day. It's our Grand Prix Sunday here at the Hampton Classic Horse Show, and there's a lot happening uh, here at the Hampton Classic around us. There sure is, but along with show jumping, there's a lot of people watching, and you know the greatest part of the Hampton Classic is along with looking at the tables, you look at everybody that comes from the different industries, whether it's the fashion industry, the entertainment industry, the, uh, you know, I have to tell you, some of the, the people who are the movers and shakers of this country are here celebrating, enjoying show jumping at its finest so let's take a little look at what's happening and our very own andrea jackson is in the vip tent right now so uh, she's got a bird's eye view let's take a look at what andrea has to show us Hey, it's Andrea Jackson. We are in the VIP tent for Grand Prix Sunday at the Hamptons Classic. This is where it all happens. This is the press line. We're going to go in onto the party area and find out who we can find and chat with. So follow me. Jackson, WVVH TV. Oh my gosh, look at this. How so beautiful. How are you, I'm Mr. Good. German? What's going on? Well, I'm here to uh, to be with my friends and see beautiful hats. Oh my God, Isn't that's that amazing. Fantastic. Best hat of the day, except this one, maybe. Well, that one is pretty spectacular. Oh, look at that. Yeah. How long have you been coming to the Hampton Classic? At least since 1995, I would really? say. Yes. Oh yeah. Mr. Yerman, how 16, about you? 16 years for me. 16 years. It used to be all the way down that corner before there was a grandstand really? there. Yeah. And you keep coming. Why do you keep coming year after year? Well, I'm a horseman. Yeah. I have a horse just about a half a mile away. Really? Yeah. And uh, it's just a great event. It's just it's great to be with the people and, and these are amazing athletes, including the horses and athlete oh, as well. Outstanding. Uh, I'm, I, I I do a little uh, a little riding myself, but western riding. And it's just, it's one to sing the same faces and yes. it's, it's great. Well, thank it's you great. so much for stopping by. No Enjoy pleasure. yourself. Have a good time. Good. We love the hat. Very good. Oh, that's fantastic! Make sure hey, you Mark, it's Andrea oh, well, Jackson. Just get a quick photo sure, and then you of can course. Congratulations, by the way, Lola. Good job, Andrea yeah. Jackson from WVVH TV, the Hamptons Television Station. Okay. Yes, congratulations. Last year, I remember watching your show. Right. You talking about the Hampton Classic? He was lead line champion last year and, and short stirrup champion this year. Fantastic, Lola. How do you feel? Good. Yeah. <laughs> Is your dream to become a Grand Prix jumper? Um, I don't know. Yeah. How, do, how does mom and dad feel about that? Well, I, I like short stirrup right now. Yeah, <laughs> short stirrup um, gives us a heart attack as it is. So um, jumping the cross rails is about as high as we're willing to endure right now. Yeah. Um, yeah. But it's magic to watch. Oh my. Yeah. It's breathtaking. It's breathtaking. Yeah. It's spellbinding. Oh my God. We love it. And and how long have you guys been coming to the Hampton Classic? This is like our fifth year, I think, right? Fifth or sixth. I mean, ever since we've been coming out here. Yeah, I mean, since since we we've always been lucky enough to um been ma we've always managed to like swipe a ticket from somebody we know, <laughs> and um and so this is the first year we actually bought tickets. Oh really? Yeah, we actually we actually got a table this year. We came honorably. Yes. Um, so I can feel good about actually walking we in. We crash it this year. <laughs> Instead of scooting in on somebody. Else's exactly. Yeah, it's exactly. so embarrassing, table, you know, so. like we're like, oh, if you ever need babysitting, whatever you need, <laughs> you know. Well, we're going to let you guys go enjoy thank the you. party. Yeah. Thank, you. Oh, thank, thank you, you so much. much. Yes, Lola, congratulations. Our table, you match our yes. table. Oh, good. Here okay. We're on. 
I'm Maurice Dubois, is yes, that right? Okay, my very good. Andrea. My name is Andrea too. Wow. Awesome. awesome. And you say Andrea. Okay. And how, everyone gets it wrong. Totally. Everyone how many? Andrea. Thank you. Now, do your parents or, or family call you Andy? I get Andy for short. Just a little bit. Okay, yeah. But Andrea, I know. People can't handle how do you it. Deal with it. I don't know. How do you get it's through the day? So, I can't. Oh I'm not sure. Now, you're on the other side today. Yes, you're a spectator. Totally. Are you enjoying it? Relaxing. We just walked in the door, and I got to tell you, this is our first time. Mine too. You're newbies. And apparently you never forget your first time. So I, here we are. I'm telling you what, I'm this already. First. What do you think? It's great. And the weather's great. We couldn't have asked for anything better today. I was here yesterday and it was a disaster. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Timing is everything, right? Yes, it is. Absolutely. Wow. Did you go barefoot in the mud? No, I wore these. Wow. Yeah, nice. right? Smart. Very sporty. <laughs> and, and Dave's got his sporto duck shoes on right there. Yes. Well, you guys. You the purple jacket. You Very know, and sporty. we kind of color coordinate, although we didn't plan it this way. <laughs> so, cool, yeah. All right. Anything exciting in the news world we should know about? Uh, no news is good news, as best we can tell. <laughs> We're going to try to keep it that way on a Sunday. Very good. You guys enjoy your first time here at the Hampton Thank Classic. You. Thank you. Have a great time. Thank you. Nice to meet another Andrea. Nice to meet you. Very good. Thank you. <laughs> where, Go get some champagne. Where is this air? Uh, WB. Talk to you. How are you? I'm good. Nice to see you nice again. Nice to see you too. All right. Are we ready to roll? Okay. Tell me who you are and how long you've been here at the Hampton Classic. Well, my name is Alan Keeley. I'm the official ringmaster for the Hampton Classic 2009, and I've been here since 1991. Let me ask you this, Alan. How does one become a ringmaster? That's a good question. <laughs> um, it, it's uh, I I kind of fell into it. Uh, working in the horse industry uh, uh, as a rider and uh, you know a groom and management but I also rode on road coaches and uh, the the attire that I'm wearing is is um, public coach guard livery that was commonly seen during the days of the coach one of my jobs that I had in the past I, I actually rode on a coach and uh, learned how to sound the coach horn and we competed and uh, when, I, when I moved east in 1989, I worked for a lady named Judy Richter and at Coker Farm, and she connected me with Steve Stevens and Tony Hitchcock. Oh my gosh. And urged me to, uh, here at this show, yes. to audition, and offered to work as a ringmaster for free to see if they liked it. So and it's really all who you know. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> did you know how to play the horn? I well, I did. I did. I taught myself how to play the horn, and the coach horn is uh, uh, basically a bugle straightened out. There's no valves. It's all embouchure. So you got some lungs on you. I do. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Alan, thank you so much for chatting with you. It's my pleasure. You're quite a character, and thank you're you. definitely uh, a mainstay here at the Hampton Classic. Well, you're very kind. Thank you, and I, I hope you enjoy the ho the horse show today. Definitely. Uh, it'll all be right. a nice one. Yes, looking forward to it. Thank you. You bet. All right. We're good. Uh, we're still waiting for the mayor. He hasn't shown up yet, but we can go. Jackson, WVVH TV, Hampton Television. All right. Great. How are you today? Good, thank you. Very good. We're looking at the course out there. Yep. What do you think? It's breathtaking to me. Um, I don't know how you uh, stay on the back of a horse and go over jumps that high. I couldn't do it. Do you hold your breath every time Georgina goes out there? Yes. There's no, no question about it. Yeah, you, I suppose you breathe once or twice during the whole <laughs> trip, but. Uh, yeah, you sort of hold and uh, you just hope that she goes over safely. Yes. It's always a bonus if she does it cleanly and wins, but the most important thing is that she's safe and the horse is safe and she has a good time and she can look back and say, you know, I know what I did right, I know what I did wrong, and she learns from it. 
Now, have you ever ridden a horse? Uh, when I was a young kid, but uh, Weston never jumped a horse <laughs> until uh, many years later, and even then, uh, only a little. And do you get to watch her very often? Unfortunately, no, because she competes all around the world, and I have a job where I have to be uh, pretty close to home all the time. Yeah, so. yeah, we think so. Now, Dave Letterman keeps giving you a bad time about the park on Broadway. Do you want to you want to talk about that? Uh, Any recourse? This is your time. Don't know what his problem is. Uh, <laughs> The traffic is a lot better, and the stores are doing a lot better. Uh, pedestrians seem to like it. You're 10 o'clock at night, still packed. And as importantly, the number of um, pedestrian car accidents has plummeted. Uh, the sidewalks just aren't big enough to hold the number of people, and so they tend to walk on the streets. This solves that problem, and that saves lives. One last question for you. Everybody's talking about... I like about Dave Letterman. Yes, I, and he seems to like you, too. One last question. Are you going to run for president? Because a lot of people would love to see you do it. Well, you're nice to say so, but uh, no. I'm running for re-election. I'll let you know what happens November 3rd. I got to... When I finish this today, I'm heading right to Brighton Beach and the Rockaways to campaign. Oh. That's uh, that's a job. Mayor Bloomberg, thank you so much. All the best. All right, okay. very good. You know, I mean, we, we talked about yeah. the equitation. That's one thing. Now, how does it prepare you for this? I'm here with Jessica Springsteen now, grand champion, leading junior rider. We talked about it earlier this week, how the equitation prepared you for the hunter, uh, well, actually for the equitation, how it really prepared you for the jumper ring. Now let's talk about how your hunters, how that's helped you with the smoothness of it. It definitely has helped me, you know, to be more smooth and to be patient and to kind of just relax. I love doing the hunters because it's more relaxing. It's not so, like, <laughs> nervous. So. But along with it not being so nervous, what the great thing is is that you have to have that composure no matter mm -hmm. what. Yeah. Yes, as you said, the hunter derby this year was the most exciting thing yeah. you've ever had. But besides that, what does it help for you as far as the smoothness between the jumps here on the jumper field? It definitely helps a lot. I mean, you kind of, it's nice during the hunters because you have more time to think. Mm -hmm. And I think you can bring that into the jumpers, kind of, you know, in between jumps, getting back, right. getting right. more relaxed, get, keeping it smooth, so. And also looking in today's course, uh, did you get a chance to walk the Grand Prix course today? Um, a little bit. I looked a little. It's big, isn't <laughs> it's it? It's huge. It's huge. I know you're going to be cheering for your stable mate, Brian Gutal. Yes, definitely. I know that because it, today it's a big course. Yeah. She's, got, she's sitting in a great spot. We're really mm -hmm. looking forward to seeing Seeing Brian go for it. Yeah. I know today's a big day. The jumps are huge. Yeah. I know you don't want to miss a minute of it, neither yeah. do I. So live at the Hampton Classic with Jessica <laughs> Springsteen. She's the winner. She did it this week. Congratulations, <laughs> Jesse. You. you did a super job. Thank We're you. here at the FTI Grand Prix back in a moment. <laughs>